Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Act Razor. Act Razor. Act Razor, the coming of the guy. Um, the guy who came here and did things. Okay. Yes. All right. <clears throat> so anyway, Fillmore is done. We have absolutely nothing to do with Fillmore ever again. Our next area, immediately to the west, is Bloodpool. I wonder how it got that name. Got our fire magic equipped. Oops. Let's go and fight. Years and years ago, there was a game show on uh, Nickelodeon that had kids like answering questions, and then they got to play video games. And, uh, depending on like if they could get through like stage one of. Bonk's Adventure with so many points or something, you got points in the game show it's a bit. And this stage was one of the games that they had to play. <clears throat> I wish I could remember the name of the game. Uh, these logs will sink, so try not to hang out on them. Kill the weird slugfish. That guy. I don't like that guy. I don't like that guy either. Oh, now you come back. <clears throat> there are no uh, non-annoying enemies in this game. Now, it's hard to tell on this version, but some of these will fall. They're colored a little uh, more obviously, I guess, in the American version. Let's play Bakhtite. hi -yo. <clears throat> We try again. No. This is a one-up. One-up. I'm in a save state. I will be using save states, if you hadn't noticed, throughout the course of this Let's Play, because some of these areas are just hard. And as... I don't want to say good as at this game as I am, but as competent as I am at this game, it's still hard. Here's our boss for area two. This is all he does. Which one of these is the magic button? There we go. Up and Y. I thought it was like the X button or something. There's fire magic. <clears throat> I was too far away. There. That helps. Time's a little short, and this boss can take forever. I don't know how he can hurt me there, but he manages to. This is basically the safe safe way to beat the boss. You can try and jump over there and hit him. And if you're good, you probably can. But then he's just going to change sides on you. But I may have to do that for sake of time. Hiya! Ooh. That probably could have killed me. So there's the end of Bloodpool Act 1. I turned the game volume down a little bit since the last video. I don't know if you guys noticed. Bloodpool has become inhabitable for humans. Let us work for the sake of these dear little humans. Something to tell you. There are many swampy areas unfit for building houses. Please use the power of the sun to drive the swampy areas so we can expand. If you hadn't noticed, that's your gimmick. Every one of these little uh, 
simulated areas have a little gimmick like that that you need to deal with. Getting your level up fairly high increases your SP, which means you can use these more. As far as we're going to go that way, got to get some points so I can blow up those bushes. This is a white dragon lair, blue dragon, I'm sorry, did it again, another blue dragon lair down there. This is the bats. We have one over here. Hidden. That guy, Red Devil. Where is he coming from? I don't know. Could it be right there? <clears throat> yep. Red Devils. There's 149 of them. You can, if you want to, <laughs> kill them all. But it takes a really long time. So the Red Devils take uh, four arrows to kill. And I believe they respawn a little slower than all the other monsters as well. I think the more hit points a monster has, the longer it takes to respawn. Red Devils use uh, like fire magic to dry up crops. Not cool. Hey. Ha! What? We're somewhat troubled. Problem is with our eldest son, Teddy. Actually, he's a bit too boisterous, and because of that, he is causing a fair number of problems. I... never mind. Trifles such as these should not be of your concern. I apologize for bothering you. And you should. I will send lightning down to burn your house. <clears throat> oh yeah. Uh, the temple here cannot be hurt by anything, as far as I know. I've yet to find something that will destroy the temples. I've tried. <clears throat> I'm God, what are they going to do? Oh, red devils, when you hit them, they back up. They fly... I thought they took four hits. Maybe I'm wrong. Anyway, they fly upwards. So if you're going to hit them, don't hit them from the side. Try and hit them from down here. How much do I need to use sun? 18, I guess. Bats are annoying. Yep. Yep. Okay, three hits. I was close. Do, 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 do. Horsey, 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 horsey. Oh yeah, every time the uh, hourglass refills... What? Many rivers, we would like to build houses, but we lack the technology to build bridges even though we know what they are. Please teach us how to build them. The people of Fillmore will know about this. Use bridge, te bridge technology. Now the lads, this land will be able to build bridges. Doom, doom. Bum, ba, da, 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 da. Bum, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, anyway, every time the little hourglass thing refills, some, if not all, of your angel's health will refill. I don't remember if it's all of it or just a little bit. Do, 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 do. Okay, almost done with that. Oh, we got a couple more bushes. Do 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 do
I wonder what's up with this place. Wow, what? We have learned to raise and cultivate a crop called rice. This was wheat in the American version. Please share this technology with other areas that do not know how to grow it yet. I will accept your offering of rice. We go back to an area that has not planted rice before. Oops. I didn't want to use that. And the... I don't know what fields turn into rice. Pew. Power of the angel. I don't know if you guys can see it, but the arrow flashes a little bit. <clears throat> and that lasts for a little while. We got enough to use them again. <clears throat> and I believe rice will feed more people. <clears throat> Excuse me. Than tomatoes or strawberries or whatever the hell they're growing. So you get a bigger population. So it's in your best interest to uh, do that. And these guys will offer it up every so often. have to kill them all. Hey. Oh no! Sneaky devil. Blew up the house. That's why I hate them. They're also the most aggressive of the monsters. you don't. Do, 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 do. And I believe if you use the rain right here, people will tell you something. The recent downpour has flooded the lake. After the waters receded, we discovered a mysterious gem on the shores of the lake. Please accept it as an offering. Rice, source of life. It's a mysterious gem, isn't it? Do, 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 da, 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 da. You gain an extra life for the next time you fight with the monsters. Do, 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 do. Oops. What? We have built a road to Fillmore, the neighboring town. We intend to teach the people of Fillmore how to cultivate rice. See? Just like SimCity. And now I don't have to do it. I heard a demon. Ha! Die. <clears throat> oh no, sad people. My son Teddy has run away from home. Everyone has searched all over for him, but in the end no one was able to find him anywhere. I am sure that wherever he is, he must be hungry. I have made some bread. Oh, I have some bread here. Father, wherever he is, please bring this bread to him. Sir. Give me your rice first. I wonder where he could be. Uh, hmm. I wonder what Teddy will think once he sees the bread his mother baked. Why is God throwing bread at me? That's what I would think. Teddy has come home after eating my home-cooked bread. He started to feel homesick and came back. It turns out that he did not run away from home, but was trying to discover why the lake is red and poisonous. 
I always thought of him as a child, but all of a sudden he's grown up. It was quite a surprise. According to Teddy, the poison in the water is coming from the monster lair next to the lake. We offer you this bleached skull that he found in the cave. Please take it. Skull of Destruction. According to the fortune teller, the gem emits a light that will destroy a monster lair. Please use it on any monster lair that we cannot seal ourselves. You use it on this one, you're screwed. Gotta use it on this one. I'm gonna wait. Waiting, waiting, waiting. I am waiting for you, game. Don't bring me down. To supervise these idiots. Yay, level up. Hit points have become 12. What's that two doing there? Oh no, the power of Angel is gone. I have to kill people normal ways. Hiya, hiya, hiya. <clears throat> and I'll level up when it hits 650. something. Uh, sculpture. Alright, now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eight. Now I will use Skull of Destruction. That's very blue. The Red Devil Lair must have been where all the poisonous water in Bloodpool's Lake was coming from. Something to tell me. We have started fishing. The other day we found one of your magic spells. We humbly present it to you. Da -da 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 -da. Shooting star magic. I like this one. What? Something terrible has happened since we sealed the last monster lair. You don't say. Monsters appeared from the long, lone castle sitting alongside the lake, demanding human sacrifices. After much hard thought, we decided to pick three sacrifices by drawing lots. And my son, Teddy, was one of those who was picked. Father, I beg you, please head to battle with the monster in the castle. Please rescue our son and all of Bloodpool. You need to change your name, guys. Alright. Let's speed this up a bit. Level up. Right, did we stop? We stopped. Dun, 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 dun. Sad people. Your god is a... Uninspired god, I guess. If you go over it again like that, it'll, it'll build all the little interconnecting roads. Doesn't really do much for you otherwise. Oh, I got one down here I can build. But I'm a completionist, damn it. That'll work. And town apparently is done constructing. So, return to heaven. I'm gonna choose shooting star magic. Magic calls countless falling stars to strike the ground, but it takes two MP to cast. So let's go and fight. So I can use this spell one time. 
Uh, from time to time, you will find a magic scroll inside some of these areas. But they only work in the area itself. You can't take it with you. you know. So if I find two, my maximum will go up to four in this level. Uh, but once I use those two, they're gone. I'm safe stating here because I don't like this part. I hate those things. They take two hits to kill. Yeah, there's a there's a magic scroll I was talking about. That is a really good sound effect for Super Nintendo game. I think. Uh, don't ride those all the way up to the top or the bottom. You will die. I hate these things. No, go away. This is a cool room. I like this room. Ah, oh, I jumped too late. Apple of Vitality. I don't know why I like it. I just think it's neat how it just kind of... Pretty sure those are instant death spikes, so try not to fall. Whoa. Yeah, what I just did, don't do that. These look safe. Surely they will not. Oh god, Mega Man platforms. I'm ignoring you guys. I hate that thing. He's like a uh, doll scene. He's got long arms. See that? It's the things from Ninja Turtles. Wow. <laughs> oh, I knew I wasn't gonna make that as soon as I jumped. Water slows you down a tad bit. It's kind of annoying. And the jump physics are a little weird in this game too, I should add. <clears throat> but not in like a game trying to screw you over way, just like a this is how people jump kind of way. Uh oh. Let's load that state. I need to be over there. Yeah, death spikes. I don't know what's in there, but I want it. No! I will get this. Probably an apple. Oh, one up. I'm not gonna use it anyway. <laughs> da -da, da -da. <laughs> up to my old sucking at this game, I am. There should be an apple somewhere. Speaking of Mega Man platforms. viewers. I'll go out and this one and then I run. Here's our boss. I don't even get to go in full health. That's never happened before. Normally, I will use the shooting star magic on this guy, but I'm waiting. I want him to get on with these upper platforms. And he's probably going to keep appearing on that side of the room, because I'm on this side. So I'll come over here. It's not where I want you, buddy. Didn't work. Alright, let's see if I can get him up 
there. That's a little better. Oof. I may die, viewers. Get him down part way and then... I'm gonna die. I died! Ah, uh, you know what? We're gonna try this again. I'd rather go in with magic and low health than no magic and full health. Well, almost full health. Yeah. Oh, that was dumb of me. Nope. That's not where I want you to appear, buddy. Save my magic for this part. And then it turns into the Sigma fight. Ooh, man. I would have died. I would have died. That didn't go too bad. Could have gone better. But not too shabby overall, I feel. I can be content with that performance. Of course they do. Thanks to you, the monsters are completely gone from Bloodpool. My son Teddy was rather brash. While at the castle as a sacrifice, searched around and found a scroll. We humbly present it to you as an offering, so please accept it. We no longer need you watching over us and can do fine on our own. Please go to other areas and make them as peaceful as this land of Bloodpool. Only if you give me stuff. Source of magic. Oh, now what? It is a shameful state of affairs that this should be a problem, but you should know what is going on. The people here have become uncivilized and savage, and Bloodpool has become a place of endless conflict and strife. I pushed the people of the town so hard to develop the city further without any care for their own situations that I drove them over the edge. Father, do you have any sort of wonderful miracle that can calm their troubled souls? Lightning. So there's nothing we can do about it now. <clears throat> Let's move. Let's see, the fields have all changed in Fillmore from tomatoes, strawberries, whatever, to rice. Our next area is right here, Itos. And we will do that one next time. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you then. Carry on.